Developing news now. A Boston police officer is recovering tonight after he was shot late this morning. It was first breaking at noon, and tonight the suspect accused of shooting the officer is in custody. Eyewitness News reporter Kelly Sullivan is live in studio now with the latest developments. Shannon, the Boston Police Commissioner says the officer who was shot is currently in ICU with a serious leg injury, but he's expected to survive. Now, the shooting happened around 1030 this morning in Dorchester on a residential street lined with single and multifamily homes. The commissioner says a known drug dealer shot an officer in the leg during a traffic stop. Officers were able to capture the suspect and recover the gun. The officer who was shot has been on the force for nine years and is a member of the drug unit. Right now, his name is not being released. I think it goes to the whole idea um, of the restraint our officers use also. You know, this individual just shot one of our officers and the officers were able to tackle him and not use deadly force and to take him into custody. And we have too many guns in the street. Uh, you know, we're working very hard. The Boston Police Department took 800 guns off the street last year, took 1,000 guns off the street the year before, but we still have too many guns. And I could say we're not going to tolerate anyone going after the Boston Police Department. And the commissioner says the suspect was on probation after being released from prison back in April. He was also driving on a suspended license. I'm Kelly Sullivan, Eyewitness News.